Well, now take down your fishing pole and meet me at the vision hole. We may not get a bite all day, but don't you rush away. Hey guys, it's Donnie with thefishingradar.com. Today we're going to be uh, reviewing a fish candy bait company, Sweet Claw. They, uh, they sent it to me in their normal Ziploc package, pretty solid package. Uh, they got their label on the front here, a little information on the bait. Got this barcode so you can scan it with one of your smartphone apps and uh, find them online. Uh, they sent me these little 3 inch, three inch baits in uh, two different colors, two different formulas. Uh, one's the green pumpkin, one's in the uh, BRB color, and it's in the regular shrink plastic. Uh, this one's going to be the green pumpkin. You can tell it's it's not set up to just you know straight straight jig like it is. You can if you got a small enough little jig head to set it up with, but uh, you'll see in my tank test that's kind of how I got it set up. I took a hook off a, a smaller craw and it worked perfect. And you'll see it land a land a fish. Kind of an odd way, but it it lands a fish. You'll see uh, these big big thin flappy uh, claws here create quite a bit of movement in the water they got this unique pattern molded in right here these little ridges that uh, cause it to move quite a bit in the water this one's going to be the one in BRB this is how I got it set up for the tank test a uh, little skirted jig head that's how I would suggest normally fishing it but uh, this one's in their standard formula it's a little little harder it'll you know hold up a little better bring it through brush and multiple hits but uh, still moves quite a bit these the softness in this particular formula I don't think matters uh, in this particular bait but uh, you know you can be the judge of that I just found found them just due to the design of the the claws that they they move just as good either way but if you've got a preference go ahead but uh you know they move really well in the water but I would suggest using it as a chunk trailer like this just because of the size of the bait and uh, then the size of the claws but uh, stay tuned for uh, the tank test so you can see it move in the water and uh, right after that we'll have the, the field test so you can see it catch a fish thanks alright this is going to be the fish candy bait company tank test for the Sweet Claw. This one's going to be in regular strength plastic in their BRB color. Uh, I got it set up here on a little skirted jig head. It's meant to be you know kind of a chunk trailer on a setup like this. There's other options you know leave that up to your imagination but this is kind of how I use it. But uh, these little thin flat claws act act great for movement I mean even even in their standard plastic it moves really well but this just to give you an idea how it's going to move in the water depending on how you got it rigged that's going to be the tank test thanks All right, today we're going to be fishing with the fish candy bait company sweet claw in uh, their BRB color, the regular strength plastic formula. It's got the red and blue little speckles inside that gray plastic. Let's see if we can catch something in here. There we go, right here at the bank. Look at that. Look at that. Stop it. There we go. Fish candy baits. Well now take down your fishing pole and meet me at the vision hole. We may not get a bite all day, but don't you rush away. What a great 
Plays to rest your bones and mighty fine for skipping stones. You feel fresh as a lemonade setting in the shade. Whether it's hot, whether it's 